What is up YouTube and welcome back to another episode of Wolf Lake Outfitters. It's me and Vic out here today. We're fishing for some jumbo perch. We're going to set some tip ups for uh, some pike. I'm getting into the end of February here. It's probably going to, bite's probably going to really pick up here. We got uh, we got that big cold spell came through and now we got some nice warm weather coming through. Be a big pressure change and the ice will quit cracking so much and those fish will start feeding again. So I think it's going to kind of be a feeding frenzy on the perch here and hopefully we get a Get a couple nice pike on the tip up. I think that we won't be able to get out there quick enough to get those up. And uh, I got a feeling that we're going to get some nice fish today. And it's going to be a fun one. So stay tuned and stay glued because we're going to get some fish. Perch down there right now. Nabbing at it. Oh, there's one. This one isn't crazy, but it's a pretty nice fish. Here he is. I'm just using a uh, little tingler spoon on my 27 inch clam straight drop. Gold color. We got a nice sunshine out today, really stand out underneath the ice. That's what we got. We're going to get some bigger ones here. We're going to get this guy back in the water and uh, stay tuned for a couple more. There's another nice one. Not quite sure how big this one is yet. About the same size as the last. We're still looking for its great grandma though. 10 plus incher to take home. Get this one back too. first big big one of the day here same me and Vicar doubled up on big old Minnesota jumbos this is what I got on I don't know what Vic's got cooking over there hold it up here show them our doubles some fat Minnesota jumbos we'll get them on the ice and there's still more down there to be caught there we go we're hooked up into a nice one not exactly sure how big this one is it might be the biggest of the day These are the donkeys we came out here for. Bing, bing, bing. Vic got a fat one down the hole too. Oh, dude. He's still down there. I got a different one. The hardest part about perch fishing is you gotta weed through the little ones to get the big ones. You'll be looking and there'll be a lot of fish. A lot of times there ain't even really any worth catching. But then when the big ones come through, they come through with a couple of them. You really gotta be able to pick them out of the group. You get him? better one not the one that's what he looks like here we're gonna throw him in the keeper pile not a bad oh there we go i hooked into the nice one this is the biggest one i've seen down here yet today really had to play with it to get it to bite this one's gonna be big oh yes that is a minnesota jumbo perch what a beautiful fish Barely got him in the side of the mouth. I actually thought he missed it when he bit. Ah, uh, there she is. That one's got to be pushing 11 inches probably. Look at the nice orange fins on the bottom. Just an absolute gorgeous fish. We'll throw that in the keeper pile. Look at its fins on there. They're all messed up. Must say I hit by a pike when he was young or something. Or even... Even when it was older, those pike would eat anything. So uh, here she is, though. I'll keep fishing. There's got to be nicer ones down there yet. Oh, hooked up into another big perch here. He came in and chased all the other ones off. And then missed it one time and came back around and hit it the second time. That is another big Minnesota perch. Come out here catching these fish. It shows that if you really put in the time, find your spot and find a good lake with nice perch that you can hammer these big ones in Minnesota. You don't need to go out to North Dakota or South Dakota to get them. It's 
just another little perch, but there's nothing the Vic likes more than getting fish slapped. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> you play too much. Oh boy. All right, well, we're going to wrap it up out here. We got a nice pile of jumbos. I don't know, probably 15 of them that we brought home. I'd say we ended up catching at least 100. A lot of small ones. You really got to pick through those those little ones to get into the big ones today. It's uh, It's been kind of slower than I thought. I expected a lot on the tip up, and we didn't even get a single fish. All we got was one pike that Vic got early in the day. I had another one, nice one bite, got off. Besides that, it's been all perch, so... Uh, yeah, hit that. We're going to wrap it up. And if you like this episode, like and subscribe. And uh, I guess I'll catch you guys on the next one.